can see that the DPF light in the Mazda 2 is flashing. Now I know the service has been done so it's not that, uh, but why I found that uh, the timing chain has stretched. So what I'm going to do is show you a way without going to the dealer to see how much the timing chain has stretched. What you will need is one of these. So first of all what you will need is an OBD reader. I've got an OBD Link LX which you can use uh, to connect to your Android phone. So you need to plug this in. Once you've connected your OBD reader to your car, you can either use the, the app that came with it, but the OBD Link is quite limited. Uh, you can buy a module for £10 specifically for Mazda, but I haven't done that. Instead, I've gone for the 4Scan light, which you can install on your Android phone. If you've got a Windows PC, you can download it for absolutely free. Uh, I've got 4Scan uh, light, so if you load that up, and connect to the reader. So if you click on error, it shows that I've got a P1336 uh, error code. So what I'm going to show you is a way of determining whether the time chain has stretched and uh, by how much. Okay, so to see how much the time chain has stretched, go to either dashboard or graph, whichever way you want, it's the same process. If I go to dashboard, and then click on the, the, the cog, PID stands for parameter identification, or parameter ID, and it's a code that you can retrieve from the vehicle for troubleshooting. The parameter that I'm looking for is called, I'll just do a search for it, CC. So it's under the PCM module and it's this one here. It's called CC DIFP WOA. CC stands for camshaft crankshaft. DIF is differential position and WOA is without adaptation. So what I want to do now, there's a box to the left of it, click on that and we go back. So now that's being selected. What you want to do is make sure the engine is nice and warm above 65 degrees Celsius, something like that, and the engine is running. So if you click add, type in CC. The one that I'm looking for is this one here, which is CCDIFP. Just highlight that. That stands for camshaft crankshaft. DIFP stands for differential position, and WOA is without adaptation. So if I then go back, it shows up. If I go back again, Because my engine's been running, if I push play, it reads the real-time value and at the moment it's showing 10.83 uh, uh, degrees difference between the camshaft and uh, crankshaft. So that's a, an indication that the timing chain has stretched. So, so that's one way of uh, determining whether your timing chain has stretched without actually opening up the engine.